Hello, my name is Ola, and I'm going to bring you to ALF on the Sega Master System by Angry Video Game Nerd. This was uh, rec recommended by Oscar Perez, and it's part of the uh, 12 Days of Crapmas, uh, which was requested by Kung Fu Geek 2, Skylar Blackwell, and Ratchet the Rat 96. Thank you for the recommendation. Um, I got to admit, uh, I did, I've never actually seen ALF. I do know of Alf. I know that uh, he's an alien from uh, another, you know, he's from another planet. Uh, he's a puppet. And uh, for some reason, like, he likes to eat cats. He eats cats. I don't know. Um, wh whoever thought of the idea must be somebody who really hates cats. <laughs> and that's messed up. <laughs> Uh, but I've heard really nothing but good things about uh, the series. Um, uh, but, you know, if you grow up with it, if you love it, that's okay, you know. Um, and uh, anyway, yeah, let's get into this. And if you want to like, comment, subscribe my channel, you can if you don't want to. That's fine, too. Here we go. Come I really love the ornaments. It's really cool. Oh no, it's ALF on the Sega Master System. Of course, it's based on the TV sitcom mm -hmm. from the 80s. I used to love that show just ah. for the fact that the star character was a puppet. Ah, yes, the lovable alien life form Alf, or Gordon Shumway, who crash lands on Earth and lives with the Tanner family, not the Tanners from Full House. The goal is to collect special items to get his spaceship working so he can leave Earth and go home, along the way, having to avoid FBI agents who are out to get him. This oh is my all God, strangely so creepy, reminiscent of E.T. on Atari 2600. These guys are creepy. Yeah. They look like pedophiles, perverts, <laughs> child molesters. Oh the way they're dressed in stereotypical trench coats and grabbing oh. at the air as if saying, Come on, yeah. Alf, I got some candy. I don't want to hurt you. I just want to grope your little alien ass. <laughs> Get out of my kitchen, you fucking sicko! <laughs> oh. What kind of town is this where there's a pedophile on every block in broad daylight? Half the population is bike riders who don't know how to pick a lane. You'll never have time to get out of their way. Alf happens to be nearsighted. In other words, the screen doesn't move until you're about a third from the edge. So the best possible chance you'll have to see what's coming up is to do this awkward walk, stop, walk, stop. Yep. <laughs> how? How? How did I die? I wasn't even on the same plane as him. Did my foot overlap or something? Even the laws of three-dimensional wow. space don't apply. So messed up. You simply can't be anywhere near this box. The graphics are forgivable, but why is it that every time Alf turns around, he disappears for a brief instant? The game can't keep up. It's like, oh, oh, wait, 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 you're turning around? Okay, wait, hold on. Okay. <laughs> You want to know what I think of the sound effects? I can't tell you that. You know why? There are no fucking sound effects! Even Atari 2600 had sound effects. Here, all you get is this rotten music. Get used to that. Somehow there happens to be a big hole in the wall in the Tanner's basement, and it leads to a cave full of bats. Jeez, Tanners, you think you might want to do something about that hole? Yeah, it's like... That makes no sense. Like, it would make more sense if, like, Alf went into a park or the woods and he stumbled upon a, a hole, a cave, you know? That would make more sense. Instead, oh, I'm going to, go into the basement, like, oh, there's a big old hole, a freaking cave full of rats and bats. Like, what? It makes no sense. Like, who, who the hell has that in their basement? <laughs> you can't miss it. It's right at the bottom of the steps. Why would that be there? Needless to say, you have no energy bar. One hit deaths. So try getting past these bats. Just, just, just fucking try. Just, just, just fucking try it. Ducking hardly helps at all. He isn't much lower. Isn't the whole point of ducking to get down low? Instead, Alf does this awkward half squat. Looks like he's getting ready to dump ass. <laughs> 
Yeah, I just hit number two. Ah. The one hit deaths is the main fatal flaw here. You could be halfway through the cave and then all of a sudden something slightly touches you and then it's all the way back to the beginning. There's a total of five lives. One continue, another five lives, and then it's all over. No more continues, no more saves, no passwords, no nothing. It's like good fucking luck, asshole. If you can progress any further in this game, you have more patience than me. Do you wish to continue playing? I love how the first choice is no. They knew nobody would ever play this piece of shit more than once. The only replay value I can think of is to do this. Yeah, hey, hey, pervert. Hey, you, you want this, pervert, right? Right? <laughs> you fucking, you dirty old man. You fucking sicko. Willie, ha, ha. Yep. Next game. <laughs> oh, man. It really seems that they had a missed opportunity there, man, to actually make it a, a fun and probably even also uh, an educational game. You know, like the Sesame Street games. Uh, but instead, nah. <laughs> you just run around. And I guess, you know, it's supposed to be like, oh, you're Alf, and that's it. <laughs> I don't know, man. Uh Uh, like I said, I didn't grow up with ALF. Uh, I, I, uh, I have, like, heard about him and all that. Um, but I've actually never seen the show. Like, I, in the 80s, like, I wasn't even born yet. Like, <laughs> um, but, like, other characters, but, no, like, other puppets. Like, uh, you know, I've seen Sesame Street. I've seen a few of uh, the Muppet movies. Uh, that's about it. <laughs> it. It was always Sesame Street, man. Like, you know, I even heard that Alf, he's actually canon in the MCU. So it's like at any point in time in the MCU, he could show up. That would be dope, man. Like if he just showed up, was like, hey, everybody be like, what? <laughs> what the hell's Alf doing here? Because <laughs> he has a, he has actually appeared in a few uh, Marvel comics, uh, and since he's an alien, uh, it would make it would make sense that he would appear in like Guardians of the Galaxy or uh, Captain Marvel movie, something like that, you know. Which that would be cool. They need to bring him back, man. Like how they did Howard the Duck. They need to bring Alf back, man. That would be so dope you know it would be kind of like you know introducing him to like a new generation kids that had never even seen or heard of alf you know that would be awesome <sighs> but like yeah uh in conclusion this game sucks <laughs> this game sucks man uh and it's it looks like it would be really disappointing to somebody who loved the show, grew up with the show, and, uh, you know, heard that, oh, they're making an F game, and they play it, they buy it, and they pay it, and they play it, and it's, and it's this. <laughs> uh, anyway, that's it. That's my reaction to Alf on the Sega Master System by Angry Video Game Nerd. Angry Video Game Nerd. Uh, everyone take care of yourselves, each other, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.